What's up everybody? It's Asian Video Gamer here. Today I'm gonna have a new type of game going on. It's Hearthstone. I've actually played this game during the beta. It was pretty fun. A throwback to a uh, card gaming style. And uh, a type of game that I haven't played in ages. I actually played Magic the Gathering when uh, it came out in uh, the 4th edition and then I stopped. Because it costs a lot of money. But you know, Hearthstone, it, Hearthstone is actually a little bit different. A lot more simplistic, but faster and uh, more fun. I also play World of, War World of Warcraft, which actually, you know, these characters are from. Um, this is my first ranked game after the June season. Which is kind of stupid because it's uh, almost end of June. So this season is going to go away really soon. But it's my first game. Whatever. I'm going to start playing some ranked games every now and then. I uh, hope people attention. like Hearthstone more than they like Dark Souls. Well, I'm still going to continue with some of the Dark Souls playthrough and uh, gameplay PvP. But I'm just going to switch around every now and then. Uh, my opponent seems kind of slow. I'm not gonna lie, I think this guy is a newbie and uh, I feel sorry for him because obviously my card's a little bit better than his considering the fact that I do have some rares out here and uh, he's using the really basic cards. Sorry dude man, sorry multi uh, multi healed. Um, but he does actually play pretty well, although some 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 mistakes he does make are a little bit um, glaring. Like right here, he should have killed my Aqualite. Would have been a card for a card. But instead, he goes for my face, which leaves my Aqualite on the board. Something you don't want to do. So I'm going to explain a little bit about my deck, my Druid deck. Uh, I don't have the legendaries, I don't have like crazy good cards. Uh, I haven't played that much in open beta, but I do have a few decent cards. I love the Druid because it's like a multi, a jack of all trade type of build, uh, character. And I guess it doesn't really translate into Hearthstone because the meta game always changed, but. I like being able to diverse my spells. The Druid has clear spells, direct damage spells, and provides strong big creatures. The three things that I love in card games. Also the side stuff can, uh, like the Auction Tier, the Aqualite, they can provide some draws. Also the uh, Starfall draws, and the Wrath. The wrath that I cast in the first few turns, if you go back and see it. So this deck kind of have a balance of uh, control, balance of big creatures, balance of draws, balance of direct damage. It's an all-round deck. And for the low tiers, this deck is actually, I feel, will probably do well. Until I get up to like, you know, rank 20 or something, once I see people using legendaries, this deck is going to fall off like really fast. And uh, one of the better creatures on this deck here, that I'm about to cast, the uh, I think it's called Shield Protector, I don't know. He actually helps, uh, keeps me alive pretty well. And uh, the Druid's ability uh, the the armor and attack actually is very very versatile you can use it as a direct damage use it to buff yourself kind of like give yourself an armor or just clear the board one damage like like that will clear out his uh, uh, holy shield right now like you can see like this my, my opponent doesn't have really good cards like he's coming out with like creatures that doesn't do a lot they're like 3-3 three, 2-3 three, three. like Tusker is actually pretty good but 
In this case, uh, I wouldn't say so. Right now, my thinking thought is, uh, should I use the Oxen tier? Should I cast them out and then coin and then do all that? Don't worry, I'm not actually going to cast on my swipe because that's stupid. That would be a stupid move when I can just clear these guys with my minions. It's been a while, guys, okay? It's been a while. So I am going to throw down my heart of the wild on this guy to clear clear his bears. And then leave him open with uh, just just the guy and then cast out my other threats. Just, just to, you know, keep the momentum to cart advantage on my side. He actually doesn't have that many cards in his hand anymore. Not as much as I have. I've been saving up. Dealing with this card. Trading a card for a card. It's actually very, very good tempo. And once I get my Oxen Tear out, um, this game will be mine if he cannot get rid of it. It seems like he can't. Uh, yeah, he's just keeping ca keep casting Tuskers and, you know, coming out with, like, small creatures. But they actually don't do much without your buffs. Reporting for duty. I really start liking like playing Hearthstone now. Like a lot of my coworkers at work, they play Hearthstone and they the really great thing about it is that it's on iPad. Although it's coming out for the Android, which is which is which would be better because I just recently got a Lenovo Yoga 10 tablet and uh, that thing runs Android. I my mom has an iPad that I bought for her a couple of years back, but I myself don't have an iPad, which is kind of a bummer because I can't play this game on the go right now. But once this game gets on, you know, Android, then I'll be able to play it. So now you can see, like, in the beginning, this guy was wrecking me with, like, small creatures, able to deal, like, 13 damage to me. He actually should have saved up his uh, Hammer of Ra uh, Righteous Hammers. Because now he he would be able to deal with two da two creatures right here, actually in this turn you could he would be able to wipe my board if he actually kept that instead of dealing damage to me, and uh, you know that would have been significantly better. Just tip for newcomers: save your spells for creatures, because this game is about filling the board. Here he makes the second mistake, where he should be actually buffing the the uh, creature that can attack. He's buffing the guy that can't attack, and uh, he's not noticing that the guy only has one, only has one damage. I think he was gonna go for my face next turn. If you have something like that, you should have buffed on that on the other creature. Well played. And uh, just face, you know, hit me in the face. You would have won next turn. Literally, you had lethal for the next turn. It's kind of sad that, you know, like you messed up, but you learn from your mistakes. I think, yeah, it would have been seven damage at me. I would have been down to five. <laughs> And then next turn, I guess, well, I guess you're still missing one damage, <laughs> unfortunately. But, you know, like, it, it would have been a lot more closer if you had that. Instead of wasting your two cards on someone that just got killed right off the bat. So, um, yeah, hope you learn your lessons. You know, for those that are watching, just, you know, keep in mind that going for face is good, but you got to calculate how it's, how it's going to work out. Don't just start throwing your parts down because, you know, you, you'll lose. But like I said, I had the card advantage. This guy could actually win, I think. He could have won. Oh, well. But, you know, don't cast 
like defense and the toughness of a creature is very important in this game. Very, very important. I actually made a mistake here. I could have just, you know, put it somewhere else and deal more damage. But I was thinking like, ah, whatever. I could. It's not like I can finish this guy. Actually, I, I had lethal. I think. No, no, no. I don't have lethal. I thought I did, but no, no I didn't. I, I didn't. I lied. So I'm drawing cards up. Oh shit! I did have lethal. What the fuck am I doing? See, even veterans like me. Eh? I made a mistake. I should have cast it hard of the while on one of my 5-5 five, five creatures. I had lethal. Shit. <laughs> Bad mistake on my part. You know. You know, going going through all these uh, gameplay after the fact, you know, really helps like shit. I gotta calm myself down, you know, like that extra turn you could have pulled something out and win the game. Oh well guys, I hope you guys enjoy. Toodles.